Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a tackle my to-do list video. I always have so much to do on Sundays and this day is no different. So today I had so many things that I wanted to get done, such as clean and organize and get up my Christmas decorations. So I had quite the long to-do list. I'm starting my day off by decluttering my dresser and little makeup basket that I have. I swear I am always decluttering this makeup basket every time I film, but seriously, it just gets so messy. I like to keep just the necessities in this basket so that I can just grab and go in the mornings when I'm trying to get ready quickly. Next on to the dresser. My dresser always gets so messy so quickly just like that little makeup basket. So I'm just collecting all of my little makeup brushes and palettes and disposing of all of the makeup wipes and trash that just piles up here so quickly on my dresser. I love this brand of cleaning products and this mum scent is amazing. Okay, does anybody have any suggestions for their jewelry? Because this is the current state of my jewelry and it really needs a lot of help. So I'm just crossing off, decluttering my makeup, and cleaning off my dresser off of my to-do list. Next, I'm going to hang this pile of clothes that I have yet to hang and I really need to get them hung and put away. Anyone else a huge laundry procrastinator? I will wash and dry, but I swear hanging them takes a lot of motivation. I'm seriously such a to-do list person and it's funny to me, I have to write down everything on my to-do list, even things like painting my nails, washing my hair, because if I don't write it down on my to-do list, it's not getting done and I'm going to forget about it. Leave a comment down below if you are a to-do list person too. Next, I'm going to put out some Christmas decorations in my room. I don't decorate a ton, but I like to just add a little pops of Christmas spirit. Had to take a picture of these shelves for reference later. But I'm just playing around trying to add some decorations on these shelves and swap them out. I was really struggling to figure out what I liked up here and you'll see the finished product. I really wasn't that in love with it, but it will do for right now. Just trying to cut these little branches that I had. I thought that they would look cute in this vase, but I couldn't get the ones cut that I like, so I ended up just putting them back in this taller vase, and I think it looks so cute. I also added this little tree on my nightstand. I always have to keep that cup of water there for my cat. That's the only place she will drink, but I love that little tree instead of a faux plant that I normally have. And I also added one on my dresser instead of that little succulent that I had there. So fun and so festive. I really, really like it. So this is how my shelves turned out. I'm not in love with it, so I'm probably going to keep playing around until I figure out how I like it. And I added a little nutcracker to these shelves. I think it's so cute. I have this little bake shop house and I really, really love it, but I can't think of where I want to add it, maybe on those shelves. And then the same goes for this wreath. I normally like to hang it up on my wall, but instead I have this sign here and I really, really love this sign. So I'm not quite sure where I want to hang it. 
All right, so the next thing on my to-do list is my Bible study. I've been trying to get in the habit of doing a Bible study every single day, and I hope that one day it's not an item on my to-do list and it just comes naturally and it's a habit that I have every single morning. But as of now, I have to make sure I add it on my to-do list or else I will forget about it and not get it done, sadly. So my Bible study consists of reading a chapter in the Bible, a devotional, and then writing out things that I'm grateful for, and journaling. We keep on talking from body to body, yeah. Getting closer to just being nothing else. I don't know if you can see that my finger is bloody, but <laughs> my cat scratched me and I wasn't aware until filming that clip. Alright, next I really gotta wash this hair. I'm on day 8 of not washing my hair and it is quite disgusting. So this is the shampoo that I always use and swear by to get the gunk out. And then I've recently been trying this Joyco shampoo and it smells amazing. I really love it. Nothing feels better than clean hair, am I right? Next, on Sundays, I always like to paint my nails for the week. I'm trying my hardest not to be a nail biter, and I notice that when I have my nails painted, I will not bite them. So I always make sure I have them painted, and I'm always drawn to these lighter white colors. So I'm trying to step out of the box and pick a color that's not a pinky nude like I've been doing lately. So I decided on this pinky mauve color instead. I mean, it's really not that much different, but slow changes. All right, so that is everything that I wanted to get done for the day. I was very productive. The only thing that I didn't get started on was editing my video, but that's okay. I will have more than enough time to do it on Monday. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to see more Tackle Your To-Do List videos in the future, then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Nothing more to say, let's just waste away One more time is all we need A bitter truth to face, not that innocent We know what we did